This is a reflex bag, a reflex ball, a reaction bag, a reaction ball, a cobra bag, a cobra ball, a viper bag, a viper ball. This particular one is from Players Boxing. It's called the Flex Air. Hello and welcome to fit to box channel. I'm Simon. I'm an amateur coach here at Telford Amateur Boxing Club. I'm a former amateur boxer and I love boxing equipment from the gloves to the head guards, the groin guards and all of the equipment that we use here in the gym. This is new to the gym. We've had it for a good few weeks now and everyone in the gym has been using it. We've given a really good testing and so today I'm going to show you the Players Boxing Flex Air Cobra Bag. Now you will remember that with Players Boxing I did a spinning bar that they did review and I also did their Cobra bag which was their previous one which was a slower unit, okay? It was slower in the spring, slower to use, this one is much faster. So over the last few weeks as I've been getting people to use this, it does take a little bit of a, a skill, it takes a little bit of practice to get used to how fast it is, and I can't tell you how many times I've seen people throw four punches and miss four punches. But once you get used to it, it's a little bit like a speed bag in that, once you get used to a speed bag, you're totally fine and you just get used to it, you can get better and better on it. So I have some footage in this today to show you sort of myself on it, but also um, a couple of other people on the Flex Air. This is, it's great for reactions, it's great for speed, and as you're using it, it is fun. So it's kind of addictive, and because it's fun and addictive, you tend to do more and more rounds, and that is a great shoulder arm condition workout as well. Now, as I say, I do prefer this one to the last one. The last one was good fun, I've still got that in my back garden, but with this one, I've bought it here to Telford Amateur Boxing Club to give it a really thorough working out, um, as we've been using it through the sessions, we've included it in sort of as one of our stations. And I have to say, just like the hit and move that I reviewed a few weeks back, this has now become that sort of equipment that I can't imagine us not having one. So I really do think that is worth the money. It is £239.99. Because it's not designed for massive hits, it is for like speed. What happens is it doesn't seem to be uh, taking too much when it comes to sort of wear and tear, especially in the spring area. I will show you a close-up of this. You get the unit, you also get a spare ball as well, just in case this one does damage. It seems fine and it's been hit a lot by a lot of people. You also get a pump, an air pump, to pump those up as well. So let's have a closer look at the Flex Air. So the players flex air, as you can see, you've got that ball on the top and that's inflated. Just inflate it at the top there. Then you've got the players logo on that side. You've also got the players logo on that side as well. And as we come down underneath, you've got sort of a plastic cup just underneath. So be careful when you're hitting it without gloves on. And then there you've got this padded area here with the black and the yellow. And then you've got that spring. And the spring is really good and really fast spring. And I'll bring that down. And as you can see, we're just coming down here, show you all around it and go to the back. Here is the height adjustment there. And that's just simply anti-clockwise to undo and clockwise to fasten. Down the bottom, they have strengthened 
with some really secure welds at the bottom just for that durability and then you've got that sort of standard base which we've put water in uh, we would be better with sanding for a more secure and as you can see at the bottom there there is 12 suction club cups as well those suction cups could stick to the floor we haven't stuck them to the floor the reason for that is we do like to move the unit around uh, especially when we've got the different sessions and so for us it does need to be portable but if you did want to fix it onto the floor put some sand in stick those sucker cups down to to the base of the floor and then you'll find that that won't move at all with the water in and with the suction cups not actually being su suckered down uh, yeah it does move a little bit but you can still have a great workout on it okay so the unit is height adjustable so you've all you've got is you've got a, a clip at the bottom here you just twist it and anti-clockwise you put it down so i'm six foot four so you can see the sort of height that that is so Bigger children can use this, no problem. And then I'll bring it right the way up to show you. So as I bring it up, you can see that's the, the length of the, the pole. So you could probably get it to, I'll just put it in perhaps an inch and a half and then tighten it up as well. So again, I'm six foot four, that's right up there. Um, oh, that's, a, that's a bit of height for me, but if you've got anybody taller, this can accommodate. I normally set it at sort of my head height or a little bit below, perhaps the chin height. And with that, it works perfect. So, a great bit of kit. I know that there's a, a few places that do this sort of generic sort of Viper ball, Viper bag, Cobra bag, co Cobra ball, um, and players obviously have put their logo on there. I know they've done a little bit of work when it comes to strengthening the base, um, but essentially there is other companies out there that do the same thing. I do think that they're great, I really do. Obviously Ryan Garcia and Canelo, they've made this type of bag really famous and really popular with their Instagram sort of posts where they're going really fast. I don't profess to be as fast as them, but I tell you what, it is fun to do. And it's also great to see how people, how good people can get on it. Um, I would say just start off slow, slow, just get used to it. And as you're starting to get used to it, you then start to get the rhythm and you try two shots, then move it up again, try three shots. And then, as you can see, you've got to try and control the ball. So let's try four shots. Okay, it starts to go a bit worry there, but you just keep moving, you can move around as well. Okay, so you can use it as if it's somebody's head and use it as a proper boxing target. Get it going. Okay, so thoroughly, thoroughly recommend Recommended retail price £250, but this is £239.99 from Players Boxing. As you know, I don't get paid by any companies. I put these things into my gym here at Telford Amateur Boxing Club. If I love them, and if the people, the boxers that come here love them, then I'll tell you about it. If they're no good, I'll tell you that as well. But so far, I've been really pleased with this bag. Hope you enjoyed that. Please like and subscribe to Fit to Box channel and I shall speak to you soon.